Hello everyone. Welcome back to Engineering Graphics through CAD Laboratory. I am Rakesh Valasa. In this video lecture, I am going to explain one important problem in projections of points in engineering drawing by ND Bar textbook. Here, the given problem is a point P is in the first coordinate. Its shortest distance from the intersection point of HP, VP, and axillary vertical plane, comma, perpendicular to the HP and VP is 70 mm, and it is equal distance from the principal planes. Draw the projections of the point and determine its distance from the HP and VP. Here, he has given one point. The point name is capital P in the first coordinate that means the point P is above HP and in front of VP that means front V is on VP top V is on HP plane he has uh, given one more condition that is shortest distance we can see the shortest distance on axillary vertical plane that means profile plane here profile plane means the plane should be perpendicular to horizontal plane and vertical plane. Draw the projections of the point and determine its distance from the HP and VP. Here already I have drawn the problem. See it. Uh, we can see the shortest distance on only profile plane. That's why I have taken uh, two reference planes that is XY and one more uh, reference line x1 y1 the intersection of these two uh, reference planes is o from o point draw the 45 degrees line uh, this shortest distance length is 70 mm here uh, i have indicated the point with uh, p double dash from p double dash draw the horizontal line and vertical line uh, by using uh, this projection we can find out the front view distance from uh, or reference intersection point and top view distance from intersection point. Let us see how to draw the given problem in AutoCAD software. First, open new file. New. Here I am selecting ACAD ISO template and click on open. Uh, this template gives this template gives units are in millimeters ok now turn off this grid lines by using function key F7 or from status bar just uh, click on this grid mode now before going to draw that uh, sketch First, we need to do few important settings. First one is units. U N enter. Precision is zero, and units to scale inserted content is millimeters. Then click on OK. Next, dimension style manager D enter. Click on modify. Move to the lines. Extend beyond dimension lines. I am taking two. Offset from origin also I am taking two. Next, move to the symbols and arrows arrow size I am taking 3 next move to the text click on this text style change the font name times new roman text height is I am taking 3 mm then click on set current the current style has been modified do you want to save your changes yes then close this window next uh, please ensure the text placement vertical is above horizontal centered next view direction left to right next move to the text alignment that is and uh, taking iso standard and also uh, check offset from this dimension and i'm taking 1 mm then move to the primary units <coughs> here uh, precision i'm taking 0, 0.0 then decimal separator i'm taking period you can see it 28.1 in the previous it has given that uh, comma 28 comma 1 so that's why i am changing from comma to period uh, 
then click on OK. Finally, you need to click on Set Current, then close this window. Next setting is Object Snap, OS Enter. Uh, please ensure the all options are selected or not. Otherwise, you need to click on Select All, then click on OK button. Next one is Set the Sheet Size. The command name is Limax, L-I-M-M-A-X, Enter. Uh, the default default size of drawing sheet size is 420 comma 297 here i am taking a4 sheet that's why i am changing 297 comma 210 this dimension gives a4 sheet size then click enter next ucs icon enter no origin the last setting is zoom setting z enter a enter okay first uh, copy this question by using uh, mouse just click here and drag to drag and select the text ctrl c copy open drawing one ctrl v paste here draw the new uh, two reference line that is x y and x1 y1 these two uh, these two reference lines perpendicular to each other the intersection point is O here I am taking line command L enter the reference line length I am taking 120, 120 enter at the midpoint from midpoint I am drawing uh, uh, one more new reference line that is X1, Y1 this height is 60 similarly draw the uh, vertical line from uh, below this xy this length is also 60 next give the names this reference line name is xy by using text command t enter small x then click on ok ok repeat the same command to other end this name is y this top one is i am taking new reference line x1 y1 T enter x1 uh, here one is the uh, subscript from text uh, text toolbar you have to select subscript then click on ok now repeat the same command at the bottom T enter uh, this name is y1 one is subscript He has given that uh, shortest distance. Uh, he has given one more condition is there. This shortest distance, it is equidistance from principal planes. Here the principal planes are x, y and x1, y1. From this is the intersection point that is O. I am taking O. From this intersection point, the shortest distance is equidistant from principal planes so x1 y the angle is 90 so equidistant means uh, that the line is at 45 degrees take line command l enter this is my starting point now turn off ortho mode the length is 70 70 ok Okay, before going to draw this length, uh, we need to turn on dynamic input. Most should turn on this dynamic input. L enter. This is my uh, intersection point. This length is 70. Less than. Less than. Angle is 45 degrees. 4 pi enter. See here. This name is P double dash. This is the shortest distance point. P double dash. Okay. Oh, this is my shortest distance point. From this point, we need to draw the one horizontal projection and one vertical projection. Take line command. From this point, draw the horizontal projection up to X1, Y1 line. And from P double dash, draw the vertical projection up to Y line. Here I am taking a 10 mm offset line. O enter. 
taken 10 mm offset 10 enter select this line click left side similarly select this line click left side okay now extend this projection up to this uh, this new vertical line new projection line ex double enter okay okay now trim this unwanted line tr double enter select this line this name is front view point so p dash p dash then click on ok ok for constructing for locating top view point we need to locate uh, we need to draw an arc from uh, here o is center and uh, you can also give the names uh, this name is m point this name is m point and uh, on x y this point name is t enter this name is n ok o a center o n radius draw the arc up to x1 y1 reference line a enter c enter this is my center point radius is o n draw the arc up to hold control button for clockwise direction hold control button draw the arc up to this x1 y1 reference line now draw the horizontal projection up to this vertical line ex double enter uh, otherwise you can take line command l enter this is my start point this is the projection horizontal projection now trim unwanted line that means extension line tr double enter yes this is my top view point t enter this name is p similarly we know that uh, uh, this p dash pws projection falls on uh, vertical plane that is front view similarly p double dash point projection falls on this horizontal plane now rotate this horizontal plane that point goes to below x y so this is the front view point this is the top view point uh, let us give the angle d a n this line and this one 45 degrees because he has clearly mentioned that equidistant from principal planes here the principal planes means horizontal plane vertical plane so equidistant means actual angle is 90 so half of uh, this is 45 this is 45 equidistance uh, here this distance o p double dash distance is 70 70 enter 70 ok ro enter ro enter m enter you can move from here to here m enter uh, he is asking that draw the projections of the point and determine its distance from the HP and VP by using uh, linear dimension DLI measure the distance from uh, this P dash to this uh, XY line 49.5 similarly repeat the linear dimension DLI enter start point and this is my first point and the second point both are same because he has clearly mentioned that equidistance so that's why front view distance and top view distance both are equal ok finally you have to give the point symbol uh, just you can move here D donut by using donut you can create the points do enter inside diameter 0 and outside diameter 2 locate p double s point this is side view point this is front view point and this is my top view point ok this is the final solution for the given problem ok after completion of this problem you can create the title block already uh, I have created title block just you can copy that title block and paste in uh, the solution just by using your mouse once click here and 
drag to drag and select this title block control c copy open drawing one and paste here control v yes okay after completion of this problem next you can apply the thickness for this border lines already uh, i have given that border length just you need to turn on by using status bar uh, status bar icon that is show or hide line weight turn on see here now convert this drawing file into pdf control p printer or plotter name is draw microsoft print to pdf paper size is a4 center the plot and uh, drawing orientation i am taking landscape because 297 length and 210 height so that's why i am using landscape what to plot select window select the area this is starting point this is my end diagonal end point apply to layout click on preview see here you can take the print out this uh, this solution before going to take the print out uh, you must fill this details title name roll number and date then click on print give the file name save as type is pdf document click on save this is the uh, this is the way to draw the given problem in autocad software and uh, to convert the drawing file into pdf i hope uh, this solution is very uh, clear to everyone thank you for watching please do like and subscribe my channel for more updates and also share to your near and dear friends